Today, we are making a recipe that mothers would love because this is one of the most favorite things their kids eat. Ano ito? Chicken nuggets from scratch. Pero ang maganda sa recipe na to, hindi lang chicken nuggets ang magagawa sa recipe na to, pwede din gumawa ng chicken boil. And I'm excited because today, I am using this wonderful, amazing machine beside me. It is the Thermomix. Buka siyang blender, no? This machine is a touch screen which has over 90,000 recipes stored here. So, hindi ka na mahirapan mag-isip ng recipe. And the nice thing about it, I need one kilo of properly chilled chicken breast cut into cubes. And the nice thing about this machine, it is also its own weighing scale. So, you just have to slip and look for the measuring mechanism and it's very sensitive no so i will measure 1000 grams or 1 kilo yan good pwede na yan extra 1 gram and to this we will add salt 1 tablespoon of salt 2 tablespoons of sugar and we are adding a bit of seasoning granules which is optional for you a teaspoon of baking soda. This is very important. One egg white. Garlic powder. White pepper. And half a teaspoon of nutmeg. So, ito siya. So, the recipe, the exact recipe is posted in the description box. So, you don't have to worry. And I'm also adding as binder a combination of Cornstarch and flour. And let's mix everything together using our thermomix. Five minutes, so we will blend it at speed eight. So this will give you a very nice bouncy texture. And now it's very aromatic, no? So it's very important that your chicken is properly chilled. After two minutes, we will add our chicken fat or vegetable oil. Four tablespoons. And this will make our chicken balls or chicken nuggets juicy. And we are done. And look at that. Very nice. Very beautifully emulsified. So this one is for my chicken nuggets. And half of it I will use to make my chicken balls. To my chicken balls, I will add just a bit of sesame oil or a tablespoon. Spring onions. And minced carrots. And I will also add a bit of black pepper. Now I will cover this up. And I don't want to chop my vegetables. I don't want to blend it along with my meat. So what I will do now, I will reverse the blade. And I will mix it for 45 seconds. And the blade is reversed so it does not blend the vegetables. It will just mix it together. Now we will start. And we are done. Look at that. Hindi nag-blend yung ating carrots. And ang ating spring onions. You still see them, no? Hindi siya nag-blend. So it's really an amazing machine. So these are two mixtures. Look at that, no? And now we will prepare our chicken nuggets. So I just have a pan lined with wax paper. And I will just add my chicken and flatten it. Diba? Ang bilis lang. Put this on top and just press, no? Wait. Let's press it down to even out our nugget. You can use a rolling pin if you want. You can use a rolling pin if you want. And let's put it in the freezer and finish it later on. And I have also prepared an ice bath. And now I have my chicken balls. Using my hand, I can just like shape the balls. 
nicely and drop them into the ice bath. The nice thing about the Thermomix is really very powerful. Pero kung wala kang Thermomix, you can do it in smaller batches with your food processor. And when you bite it, it's chewy. Yun talaga yung gusto natin. May bite. Meaty pa rin yung texture niya. Hindi siya magaspang, no? Hindi siya parang bola-bola. So, let's start cooking our chicken balls. We have some water. And we salt it. Medyo generous yung pag-salt natin, ha? And very low heat because we just want to poach our chicken balls. Tinan mo, no? Nag-firm up siya once it was soaked in ice-cold water. And we will add that there. And malalaman natin siyang maluto siya dahil lulutang siya ng konti, no? So, dapat ganun lang. We don't want it to boil, no? So, very gently. And we also have a bowl of ice water when it's cooked. Little by little, lulutang na tong ating chicken balls. And, mangyayari din dito ay magiging maputi yung ating chicken balls, no? Once maging maputi na yung ating chicken balls, makikita mo yung mga studs of green and orange sa ating carrots and spring onions. And luto na yung ating first batch of chicken balls that are very nice. And we will drop it into our ice bath. Ayan. Ito yung sinasabi ko na magbabounce. Oh. Parang bola. Oh. And I will just cut just to show you the insides of our chicken balls. Look at the texture of our chicken balls. And I will taste. Hmm? Perfect. Perfect siya. And now, we will prepare our chicken nuggets. Slightly chilled. And we have our breading mixture, flour, eggs, and breadcrumbs. Very simple to do. I will just season the eggs with a bit of salt and the flour as well with a little salt. I will just use my pastry cutter, cut them into nugget sizes. As big or as small as you like them. Doesn't have to be standard. You can also freeze and use a cookie cutter for different shapes. Now, you can just like massage and coat in our flour. You can season your flour with other spices as well like paprika and black pepper. But for this, I'm just using salt. Now, let's coat it with our egg. And now, our breadcrumbs. So, if you want to keep this in the freezer, you can actually steam the nuggets before coating in our breadcrumbs. But these ones are ready to fry. And using our chicken balls and our nuggets, we will prepare our dishes. Chicken balls and noodle soup with vegetables. I'm just adding around five and I will just add vegetables and let that simmer. Napakadali. And I'll also add like sliced mushrooms and young corn. Let it simmer. Napakabilis lang. And now, we will also fry our chicken nuggets on the other side. Ito, we just want to keep moving it around so it fries evenly. Diba? Yan. Season our soup with a little bit of salt. Yan. Yan, no? And let that cook a little while. And we will add our noodles. Now I will add my sotanghon noodles. And let that cook. Napakadali lang. Very simple. From our ready made chicken balls. Let that cook. Finish with black pepper. Yan. And luto na rin yung ating chicken nuggets kasi lumulutang na siya. Oh, very nice, no? But we just want to cook it more evenly, more golden. I have my colander here. 
Ganda ng chicken nuggets ko. Gusto mo ng recipe? Eto, panoorin nyo itong video na to. Yan. Ano bang masarap na sausawan sa chicken nuggets, guys? Tell me what you like. Now, I will also fry a bit of our chicken balls. Eto, masarap din ito pang halo, pang sahog sa pansit. Sa chapsuy. Di ba? Mas masarap pa to sa chicken balls na bibenta sa kanto. Of course, premium. Di ba? So, kung gusto nyo ng recipe ng ating very beautiful and perfect chicken nuggets, look at that. Oh, watch the video, ha? And our sabaw is also done. Mm. Woohoo! Ang sarap! Mm. At may pasabaw na tayo using our chicken balls. Diba? Ang sarap-sarap, oh. Beautiful. Yan, oh. May sabaw, kompletong ulam. Ang bango. Perfect. Now, I will show you. We will cut into our nuggets just to show you a cross-section. It's perfect inside, no? Yung tamang texture. Gusto nyo ng recipe? Mmm! The perfect. Chewy, juicy, crunchy outside. Malinom na. Perfect. Chicken nuggets. Watch the video. Ito, mas masarap ito kaysa sa nabibili sa kanto. Kasi of course, premium. And ito kong chicken nuggets. It's so perfect. Better than the fast food or the grocery version. And what we will do, we will make tusok-tusok our chicken balls. Sarap! Ang ganda ng gawa natin today, homemade chicken balls, fried. Ito siya, boiled into a noodle soup with sotanghon. And ito, our homemade chicken nuggets. Mas masarap pa kaysa sa fast food. Try these recipes! But don't forget to subscribe to the Chef Tatung YouTube channel kasi marami tayong ituturo na ito, mga teknik, mga style at discarte para sumarap ang luto niyo sa bahay. And look at that! Isang base recipe lang tayo. Pero ito yung produkto natin. Napakasaya, napakadali lang. Kaya try these recipes! Ang ating homemade chicken nuggets and homemade chicken balls, simple!